In today's video, we're making a big announcement for this upcoming week. What's up guys, we're back with another video where we are announcing a series coming up in this coming week called Legacy Week GX Edition. Now, if you've been around for a long time, you know Legacy Week is something we've done a few times where we open a week long old school opening whereas every day had a different set opened. We've never done it for GX though. And now we are officially starting. So today we're not actually gonna be opening uh, some of the sets, but we are gonna be opening Legendary Collection GX in honor of GX, so makes sense. But before we get into it, we have a giveaway. I'll be giving away this Burst Return, Element Zero Flame Wingman from Duelist Pack, this is GX, and Arm Dragon Level 10, also a Duelist Pack GX set. So just like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications and let me know down below what you're most excited about seeing in legacy week gx edition i keep wanting to say legacy edition legacy collection or i don't know what i'm saying but legacy week gx edition all right so before we start opening some legendary collection gx one of my favorite things to open up perfect i mean it just fits perfectly with gx legacy week we have a bunch of sets that will be open this week so before in other legacy weeks it's been like a 24 pack opening of each i don't actually have 24 packs of each of these sets so what we're gonna do is a little bit slightly different, but it still will be really fun. I have a bunch of different Legacy GX sets. So we have almost 20 packs of Shadow of Infinity that will be open, opening up. These obviously we're gonna be trying to pull the Sacred Beast. We've never pulled them before. Maybe could happen. That's gonna be awesome. This will be one video. I also have a bunch of Jaden Yuki Duelist packs, which is Duelist pack one. I think this is where you can get the Flame Wingman that we're giving away today. So that'll be pretty cool if we can pull that. A bunch of these, that might be 20. I didn't count them all out. So a decent amount there. Then we get into like the really big ones. I mean, Shadow Infinity is pretty big, but we have Gladiator's Assault. This is like 16, 17, 18, 19 packs, something like that. So a decent amount. We all also have Light of Destruction, you know, in honor of the reprint coming up. This is, I think, the most packs I have. So as you can see, some of these are a little bit different than others. Look, look how much wider that one is than that one. But we'll see if that matters when we do the opening. And we have some Phantom Darkness. Unfortunately, I don't have as many Phantom Darkness. But what I'm going to do to make, you know, a lot of these a little bit more of a full booster box, like 24 packs, is I have a bunch of Chaz Princeton packs that we're gonna kind of disperse throughout the week. So mo a lot of them will be on Phantom Darkness because we only have a few packs of Phantom Darkness, but we obviously are not gonna skip Phantom Darkness if we can do it, because it's a great set. So we're gonna be opening these up throughout the week. So that will give us five separate videos that will be coming after this. So the next five days, you're gonna be seeing Legacy Week GX Edition. So if you're excited about it, make sure you let, let me know down below. What do you wanna see the most out of all these packs? Because we got Ghost Rare Potential, we got Ultimate Rare Sacred Beast Potential, we've got uh, Secret Rare Magic Formula Potential. There's all kinds of crazy stuff. Dark Arm Dragon Secret Rare. So I'm really excited to do all of that. And that's going to be happening in this coming week. So don't miss it. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you just check in Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. I say that and this could be a Monday then you're seeing this. But if that's the case, then it'll go to Saturday. So don't worry. It'll be for the next five days. All right, let's get started. I know the announcement took a while, but that is kind of the main purpose of the video. This is kind of just to, you know, guide us into GX Legacy Week. And what better set to do it than like Legendary Collect Legacy legendary being in the same video very very this is rough for me okay tongue twister but we also got to open a couple of these recently so i always have fun opening up these 25th not 25th anniversary these uh legendary collection man there are too many products that are the same okay it is really getting to me so let's open the first one we have three of these we're going to open up today i'm very excited for this and hopefully we can pull something big like the cyber in dragon cyber dragon alternate art I actually like the Cyber Dragon regular art better in Secret Rare, but let's see if we can get it. Fusion Recovery, Crystal Ride Geki. I mean, I'm excited. I think uh, Legacy Week GX Edition, which I need a better name. Speaking of Cyber Dragon alternate art, there it is right off the bat. We've already gotten one. I need a better name because I'm tongue twister by my own name. And that means it's a bad name. Okay, that that's... That's the definition of a bad name, but guess what? It's already been named. It's in the video. We can't change it now. Legacy Week GX Edition. Legacy Week GX. It sounds like a Yu-Gi-Oh product. I mean, it's perfect. It's perfect, except for the fact that I can't say it. Elemental Recharge. We have Grandmaster the Six Samurai. We've got the Shaman. Let's try to pull another big secret rare. Chamberlain. Diamond Dude secret or super rare. And a, oh, Darius is pretty good. Gladiator Beast Darius. Defensive tactics? No, do not be in glass this week, please. No defensive tactics. And Gladiator Beast's Respite. All right, off to a decent start. We have a total of uh, 15 Legendary Collection 2 packs to be open today. There are five per box. These are getting, uh, you know, harder and harder to find. As, I mean, they're still not that hard, but they're getting there because they are pretty old at this point. Wild Wing Man, they did have a reprint like several years ago. Crystal Beast, Amber Mammoth, Hero Barrier. We have Evil Hero, Inferno, Wing, a nice super. The new angle is just really crushing these. 
these rarities. They look great. Uh, ooh, Cyber Twin Dragon. Am I crushing? I mean, good. That doesn't make sense. <laughs> Cyber Twin Dragon and Gladiator Beast Lanista. I don't even remember. I don't remember this Gladiator Beast. What does it do? Special summon by the effect. Target one Gladiator Beast. Your monster great. Ba banish that target. I don't know what I'm saying. And this card's name becomes that target's name. Okay, so you would special this. You would banish one from your graveyard, and then you get to have that effect. So that's kind of cool. It kind of could be any Gladiator Beast if they're in the graveyard to be banished. And so, of course, somebody DD crows them, and then you just, it just whiffs. So that, that feels bad. Two packs left. Here we go. Two packs in this box, at least. Fusion Recover. We have O Oversoul. R Righteous Justice. We have Prisma. This used to be like a $10 common. I don't know if it still is, but I'm going to pull it out. Heroes Bond. The Grand Neos. That is, man, the supers just look good at this angle. Uh, why have I not had this amazing angle for so long? Oh, and a Dark Arm Dragon. Dark End Dragon. This is for Edison Format. And Evil Hero Infernal Sniper. Very cool with the Destiny Mirage. All right, final pack of the first box. GX Legacy Week starting off hot. We are going to be comparing um, as we go some of the prices. The thing is, it's going to be a little bit hard because the prices are all a little different, but we'll try to do that as we go and see which pulls the most value. Even though some have a couple more packs and some will have chads and we'll just see what happens though. Anyway, just for fun, Ice Master. System down. I have a hiccup coming and I am fighting it back. We have Plasma, super rare, okay? And a Skyscraper 2 Hero City, not great. Uh, Lumina, not bad. Also still not expensive though, even though it is Lumina and it is used a little bit, but it is only like a dollar or less. Next box, here we go. I'm gonna get this thing open real quick over here because these boxes are just massive and don't fit on the screen. The new angle's great. The problem is there's not as much room. It's even less room than before. So it's kind of a, uh, you got to sacrifice a little bit to get the, uh, the rarities looking better. All right, more promo pack. Five packs. Legacy Week GX Edition. Legendary Collection GX Edition. Dual Academy Years. Here we go. Two from the back. We have Destiny or Captain Tenacious Skyscraper. Ancient City Rainbow Ruins, that's a Ruxa special. Pass, the double dude just dropped it. We have Dark Bright, boom, and ooh, a quest. Okay, so we're getting some uh, Gladiator Beasts here. That's nice. Armatop the Chaos Phantom. And D-Time, D-Time. We got ourselves a D-Time, everybody. That's a nice card, D-Time, a classic. All right, a first pack, pretty good, honestly. A quest, D-Time. Can't ask for much more than that. Let's do two from the back here. We have Voltic, Offering of the Snake Deity, Cold Enchanter. D Shield, a cheated heart, Dark Lord Desire, super rare, and Gladiator Beast. Hoplomus, this is the Gladiator Beast opening. We're pulling everything Proto Cyber Dragon and Bubble Shuffle in honor of some very GX specific cards, the Elemental Heroes and Cyber Dragons. Keep it going. Keep it opening. That was a weird way to open that, but it worked out, I guess. It worked out. We have Amethyst Cats, Wild Wingman, Chairman of the Six Samurai, Deformation. We have Dogma. See where we're coming and a disc commander. Okay. Shun Doji, not a great ultra. The ultras in here are really kind of the weaker, the weaker rarity. There's not a lot of great ultras. Two more packs. Here we go. I think if I had to decide which I'm most excited about for uh, Legacy Week, honestly, it's probably Phantom Darkness, even though there's not as many packs. We just have not opened a lot of Phantom Darkness before. Sparkman, we have Cunning the Six Samurai, Glow Moss. So I'm really excited for that. Hopefully pull Dad or something would be awesome. Uh, Grand Neos, I do need to upgrade my uh, Dark Arm Dragon. Currently, I'm using a Legendary Collection Kaiba Secret Rare. I mean, yeah, I could. I have an Ultimate Rare PSA 9 that I could take out, but the ultis are a little flimsy. I'd rather use the Phantom Darkness version. Okay, Grand Neos, let's see what the Secret Rare is. Test Tiger, <laughs> man, they really are Gladiator Beast right now. That's crazy. The Secret Rare, look at that. Crushing, that looks so good. All right, that is amazing. Arcus, that's somewhat usable. And then the... Uh, Elemental Hero Nasp, Nasp, Knasp. I don't know if it's silent or not. We have, oh, wait, we have a, uh, don't forget our uh, Grand Mole. Oh, Neos is in the wrong pile, whoops. Okay, last pack of the second box. We have one more box after this. GX Legacy Week being kicked off. And uh, also next week after GX Legacy Week, we have a new set release. So it's gonna be pretty fun. Uh, Gateway the Six. I will also be at uh, Card Party 2 this coming week. Uh, it's like the 14th, 15th, 16th, something like that. So if you guys are gonna be there, come say hi. I know it's more of a Pokemon event, but come say hi if you are there. We have Dogma, super rare. And a Neos Alias, man, we're pulling some great cards. Instant Fusion, there's the probably the best Ultra in the set. Instant Fusion is really solid. It's only at one now, so it's gonna be a little bit less valuable, but who knows, maybe it'll come back to three. It'll be more more expensive and stuff. So pretty good. We're on to the last box. Uh, so far, I think we're doing pretty well. All right, promo pack, five packs. Here we go. Last five packs before we uh, launch into an amazing week of GX openings. 
Hopefully you guys enjoy them. They should be pretty fun. I'm excited. Okay, Destiny Signal. Let's just start off with an amazing pull here. We have Hero Mask, Aqua Dolphin, Rainbow Gravity, Venomenon, the poison, King of Poison Snakes. Okay. And Disc Commander again. So a repeat. Okay, Magical Mallet's also a decent ultra. That's a couple bucks, I think. Not bad at all. All right. Four packs left. We need a little luck, everybody. Let's get a secret rare right here. We have Flare Neos. I mean, a lot of these commons, I really should probably be pulling out these elemental heroes. Hero Counter Attack, Grinder Golem, Terra Firma, and a Skyscraper 2 Hero City. Never a great one to see. Cyber Valley's good, though, for Edison and stuff. And Dark Calling used to be good. I don't know if it still is, but okay, maybe not too bad. Three packs left in this opening. Mega Pack Legendary Collection 2 at the Duel Academy Years. Give us Cyber End Dragon. Give us Shining Flare Wingman. Give us Elemental Hero Flame Wingman. We have Blade, Mas Blade Master. Okay. And with this cat, we have DD Survivor. Light of Redemption. Rainbow Neos. This used to be a huge card. I think it got a reprint, but this as a calm, it was like 15 bucks for a while. Secret Rare is oh, Hoplomus again. All right. Some reprint. Oh, repeats today. Chaos Neos. That's probably pretty solid. Okay, Chaos Neos. Neo Space and Dark City honestly feels like a pretty good pack right there. A lot, anytime there's a lot of Neos of any any sort of form or anything, that's really good. Okay, two from the back. We have a Neo Space and Grand Mall. Destiny Signal. Thunder King Ryo. That's a really good one. Okay, yeah, Thunder King Ryo. Fantastic pull. Ancient City Rainbow Ruins. The Elemental Hero Tempest. Super rare. Let's get a big secret right here. Destiny draw, not bad, not not big, but pretty decent. Jane is decent as well, Crystal Beacon, and Wild Wingman. Honestly, we are just pulling some fire right now. Lots of money cards so far. Last pack in the opening. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you have, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Don't forget, the next five days are gonna be Legacy GX openings. If you like old school GX, don't miss them. Make sure you subscribe, turn on that bell. I haven't said that in a long time. Turn on the bell, yeah. That way you know when I've uh, posted the video. Usually around, it's usually 12 o'clock. Sometimes they've been late, sometimes they've been early, but usually it's around 12. That's what you can, we usually bank on. All right, last pack. <sighs> Send us some luck in the comments. Here we go, Venom Swamp. We have D Fortune. Let's pull a big secret rare, whether it be Shining Flare Wingman, Cyber End Dragon, regular Cyber Dragon. We have Disney or Doom Lord. Rocks and Special. H Heated Heart. Six Samurai Yuriza. Okay, Elemental Hero Woodsman. So here's what we're going to do. So there's an Ultra here, and then there's a Common here, I think. So let's do this. Oh, no, a Rare. Sorry. The Glonios. This is actually the biggest Rare, I think. This is a really nice Rare. It's like 7 bucks, so that's pretty solid. There's the Woodsman again. So two Elemental Heroes in our Rare and Up slot so far. We're two for two. Let's see if the Ultra is going to be one. Glad to be Slinista again. Okay, last card of the opening. Here we go. Don't forget to check out Ruxin34.com if you haven't recently. There's a lot of cool stuff on there, whether PSA cards, sealed products, stuff like that. I have some GX boxes and stuff like that. So go check that out if you want to support the channel. Here we go. Last card. Oh, Evil Hero Malicious Edge. It's going to be an evil, malicious opening. That The secret rare just really pops at this angle. Looks really, really nice. So Legacy Week GX Edition is coming. Make sure you guys are subscribed. It's going to be super fun. Shout out to Toll Info Show, Ernesto Deanna, America Deutscher, KK Beats, Brandon Chaney, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Robert F. Changeling, and Adelso Garcia Jr. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.